Hi friends, uh, good morning everyone. I hope all of you are doing good and safe. I came with uh, this concept of sharing few real-time tips. I hope it will be helpful for you. Let's take the first example. Let's take the case you are in the month end and uh, there was an issue was raised by the user. The key user has raised an issue. You are in a support project. Key user has raised an issue and the issue fix is like they have to go and cancel a material document. Because of that cancellation missing, there was uh, they're not able to post uh, invoice receipt or certain kind of issues happening. So the solution is you have to cancel a material document. So you ask that user to please cancel this material document, then your issue will be resolved. Then user has mentioned to you that uh, I'm busy with outside uh, or I'm at the shop floor. Okay, uh, that is urgently required. Can you do that? You have access to MIGO cancellation with your user ID. Is it recommended to cancel the material document with your consultant user ID? The answer is no. You should never perform business transaction with your production user ID. You have to use your ID only to analyze, to check the report, to check the table data. You have to see all that information, but you should never post the documents or you never change the material master or vendor master, customer master. What I mean to say any business transactions like master data changes or transaction postings, you should not do it. In very special cases, we may do that by taking Power ID or Super ID or uh, Firefighter ID. D different projects may use the different word. There will be a separate ID where business cannot handle that situation. So only consultant has to do that. Then we will request for that ID and we provide the information why you are doing that. What is the purpose of doing that activity? And uh, then we use that ID to resolve it. Other than those special cases where you have to use the Power ID only because in the audit you have to explain the Power ID is used to do the business transaction because the user is not able to handle that and it should be fixed on urgent basis. It's any reason we have to provide. So the answer is you should never post material master or uh, transaction data related to users. I hope it is clear for you. You should never do in your real time, although user is requesting to you. Thanks for watching. Have a good day.